nope. I'm sorry. What's up y'all, it's Shanice, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So as you can see, I am soaking wet. I literally just hopped out of the shower and came and sit down on this chair and I have water just dripping all down me right now. My hair is literally soaking wet. But anyways, let's just hop right into this video. So your girl was just casually browsing in Target, you know, going through the aisles and everything and then I'm like, what? When did Garnier come out with these three new products catered to natural hair? So I decided to pick up all three products and they are part of the Garnier Fruity Style Curl Treat line. As you know, they do have the little one minute deep conditioners, which I have not tried yet. So these are all of the products right here. And these are pretty big jars and I think they were $6.99 a piece. So I picked up the Smoothie Defining Cream for fine normal hair. I got the Butter Hydrating for normal coarse hair. And then I also got the jelly shaping for all hair types. So my hair is super soaking wet right now, but I'm just going to part it down the middle just so it's easier to disperse the products. And I'm going to work on one side first. All right, so on my left side, I think it's you guys is right. I'm going to be using the smoothie defining for fine normal hair. And pretty much all it says is section hair applies sparingly to damp hair, rake through hair with fingers to shape curls and let it dry. So I'm a little low key nervous to try this out, but we'll see. And I'm gonna list all the ingredients down below as well. So here we go. So, so it doesn't smell bad. It literally has like a really light smell, which I like. Yeah, it's really, really light smell, and this is pretty thick for it to be for fine hair. Yeah, so I just put a little bit of it into my hand. I probably am going to use more. So it's, it goes on really, really smooth. I'm going to spray my hair a little bit more with water. I kind of know, like, right away if a product is going to, like, work for me <laughs> from putting it onto my hair. And this is looking like a no already, honestly. Cause it's gonna make my curls feel a certain way, whether that's like smoothing it out or I'm gonna see like definition right away. Um, this right now is not really giving me that. So I'm a little bit nervous, but maybe after applying the, the jelly, that will help out. So I can say that it went on pretty smooth, like it feels good. Um, but my curls are still frizzy, really frizzy, all over. And I'm using the same technique that I always do, so yeah. So on top of that, I'm going to be using the jelly shaping for all hair types. This is super, super jelly, jello-y. I noticed that I'm not a fan of, wow, this is really like, it's like goop. It's literally like goop. Not really what I was expecting. Um, I'm not really sure if I'm a fan of these type of products. They usually don't work in my hair. Like I've tried the Shea Moisture one and all that and it's a no. For this it says you need a quarter size amount but you know us naturals, we never use quarter size amount. So I'm gonna use this much for now and I'm gonna apply this all over this section and see if that helps define my curls. Okay. 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 That looks like it's really helping define my curls. Okay, so this is how my hair looks so far. The jelly went on pretty, pretty smooth, which I like, but after you leave it alone, I, it just frizzing up. It's not doing what I would want my curls to do. So I feel like at this moment, I just, I honestly want to stop. <laughs> I really do. I'm going to try to mix them together and see what happens. And we're going to add some more water. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. No, ma'am. Thank you. 
So for my wash and goes lately, I just um, kind of rake my hair until it's all the way smooth and you can't really see a curl and then I let the curl kind of form on its own and that's how I've been getting like really really defined curls a lot of people have been asking me um, like have you like did something new with your hair and that's nope I'm sorry I there's no point in me continuing what is this you guys can't see I don't know if you guys can see it up close but I can and it's literally like frizzy everywhere and i know this is gonna be a waste of my time so i'm not gonna waste your time my hair does not look like that when i'm gonna get a good wash and go for a fact i'm here thinking you know i'm gonna have a good wash and go or an okay wash and go but this is a terrible wash and go like i cannot even tell you the last time that i've used that i've used products and it made my hair look like this i cannot tell you the last time even if they aren't my go-to products and their drugstore or whatever the case is, I've never seen the, these results in my life, ever. I want to do a little experiment here because I want to see if it's possibly possibly just this jelly or possibly just this cream. Let me tell you, on this bottle here, it also says for hydrated up to 24 hours, frizz resistant curls with no greasy way down that whole line right there hell no that is a lie at least for me that is a lie because my curls are frizzy af the curls like look super like way down and greasy looking i can't even believe this right now i'm pro i probably seem like i'm over exaggerating but i've literally never seen my hair do this before so on this side i'm actually going to use my favorite products and you guys are i want to show you guys the difference in what i'm talking about so first i like to go into my cocoa cream right here from carol's daughter which is really really good for moisturizing my hair and now i'm going to take the texture id on top of that and then on top of that I'm going to use my gel my Diva Curl Ultra Defining Gel and then I also like to take a little bit of the texture ID as well mix it together add some water so guys you can clearly see the difference in what i'm talking about this is the garnier side right here which turned my hair into i don't even know it's just frizzy and then this is the other side where i use the products that i usually you know use on my hair there's definitely a lot less frizz my curls are way more defined and yeah that's just it so on this side right here i'm gonna use the butter hydrating <laughs> and then on top of that i'm going to use the diva curl i think honestly it's both of the products together they just both they all suck. <laughs> Let's see if my Diva Curl could help with this process. Okay guys, so I think um, I'm done here. I'm just not even going to bother. And this was an absolute waste of my money. Simple as that. Um, so I'm definitely going to put this video out there just so you guys can see as well. And you guys, if you guys come across these products, that's on you. Um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. This just goes to show you that not all the time my hair comes out bomb. Not all the time do I use products that are amazing. I thought these would work out good, you know. So anyways, let me know if you guys tried out these products, how you guys like it or if you don't like it. Um, let me know, share your thoughts down below, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. So I'm back, and I just honestly don't know why I had such high expectations for these products. 
I don't know. I really did though, but at the end of the day, it did not work for me. Um, and I'm just not a fan. Like those products are canceled for me. Like look at this side compared to this side. <laughs> I have no, I have nothing else to say. Uh -huh. Uh -huh.